Hello, my people. Are you guys the way? It's a girl, Edo from the mountain kingdom of Lesotho. Yes, guys. Uh, they say baby mama had got trauma. Girl, have you ever dealt with baby daddy trauma? Oh, my God. This, this gender, though. <laughs> Legenda le oh my god this gender i'm telling you guys if you haven't dealt with baby mama uh baby mama or baby daddy drama i i, I i'm really envying you you are so like guys they talk about us baby mamas like we are the one who's causing all the trauma with the baby daddies we go to their houses, we cause drama so that they can break up with their wives. No. Honey, no. Check your man. Check that guy. That guy just because he has a baby with you. They feel like they're entitled to your life. They want to control your life. I'm telling you. They want to control who, who you bring to your house. Who's going to meet your baby? The baby that they're not even maintaining. Or the baby that they're not even claiming. They only claim the baby when they want to, to get into bed with you. You know, they always want to come back. They will claim that you are their wife. Even though they are married, legally married. You're just having a baby with this guy. In fact, this guy is just a sperm donor. Yes, that's right. He never ever come to spend time with their kids. They never ever buy their kids anything. But they will come and tell you and cause trauma whenever they feel like it's convenient for them. Or maybe when they are when the class is no longer cleaner at the other side, they remember you. They will come and they will try to make your life miserable just because they late in bed with you and you produce that child. Boy, get a act together. Get a life. The only thing that is still connecting you to this woman is the baby. You no longer any, have any say in that woman's life. I'm telling you, you don't want to see you date. Not at all. You don't have to date when you're a baby mom. You don't date at all. Because they don't know the man that you are bringing close to their children. That's what they say. <laughs> Ooh, baby daddies. They will come and threaten you with divorce. The lawyers, they, they will take you to court. They are going to take your kid. You are never going to see the baby no more. Because maybe they perceive you not a fit mother. You wonder, I raised, I carried this baby for nine months. I raised this baby up until she's this old. And now you come and tell me that you're going to take my kid. Man, bye. Seriously? You're going to come here and tell me that I'm, not a, I'm no longer a feed mother. When my child is 10 or 11 years old. Oh, God. <laughs> you guys, you guys, you don't know the baby that is, I'm telling you. They will tell you the things that you did when you're still dating, the things that made you happy when you're still dating. They will forget about the kid. They want to come back to your life whenever they feel like it's convenient, whenever they feel like it's necessary for them. Then they will start going back into time. Imagine, back into time. They will tell you how their mother used to love you, how their father used to love you, blah, blah, your friends and everything. But remember, this man left you. This man is the one who chose to get off and step, get stepping. Or maybe, maybe you are the one who chose to leave, but there's still a baby involved. You have to separate your issues. The only thing that's still keeping you so that you can still keep touch with this man or this woman is that child concentrate on the child 
Make sure that you build a relationship with the child. Leave the baby mama alone eating whatever that he is doing. If that woman is whoring, let that woman haul. It is her life. As long as she is still taking care of the kid, protecting the kid and everything, let that woman haul. Darling, it is her life. You had your time with her. It is now over. You take care of your business, which is the baby. Leave that woman alone. I'm telling you. Leave that woman alone. Guys, tell me, what is your experience with baby mama or baby daddies? What is that from? What have they brought to your life that you feel like, oh, shit. Why did even I make a baby with this person? Comment on the comments section below. Guys, I love you. Don't forget to subscribe.